Hey. Just like to say you thank you for all the subscribers and people that are commenting in the box below. Thank you for that. And uh, it's basically the people that have looked at me and said, right, I want to see more of what this gig's doing. So you're pretty weird. But thank you. Good weird. Um, if you know any more weird people, spread it out. Tell people. I like weird people. Come follow me. Subscribe. Uh, put a link down in, uh, in the comments about my Instagram page. Uh, it's Electrophobiac. If you can't spell that, well, look it up or something. I don't really mind. Um, today's episode, I'm going to be talking about little brothers, little sisters, the little siblings, the really, really annoying ones. You got it. The younger sibling can basically get away with anything. Yeah. You can both do the same thing. However, the younger one is going to get less, if any, punishment. It's like, because we're older we should know better, therefore we get more of a punishment. Though we're only a year or so older, in most cases, than the younger sibling. In real life, that doesn't make much of a difference. Older siblings are always the test subjects. Because they come first, the parents have, let's say, little or no idea what they're doing. So everything is tested out, they decide, yes, I'm going to be strict, I'm going to be the best parent, I'm going to learn from everyone else's mistakes, I'm going to do this, this, blah, 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 blah. It doesn't really matter. They're going to mess up, it's going to happen, all parents do. Um, but the second child, they've decided that they're not going to do the strict route. They're not going to do any of this nice stuff. Yeah, I say nice. Not so much. They decide that they're going to take it a little bit easier, be nicer, you know, all that sort of stuff, but then that sort of spoils the child. They have everything, or, or at least almost everything, easy. So, take this, for example. An older sibling will go through school, they will take their GCSEs, and they'll find out that a certain subject, uh, for example, art, is quite difficult, lots of homework. They know that the younger child is rubbish with homework, doesn't do much homework. They will warn them saying, art has loads and loads of homework to do. However, because you said don't do it, they will automatically do it, ignoring any advice that the older one gives. Now this, I know for a fact, is really annoying. I've completely forgotten what I'm going to say next. A lot of this is improvisation. Actually, all of this is improv. Great. And so, yeah, that was this episode. That was the younger siblings. Reasons why they're annoying, and basically I haven't put any reasons in why they're not. So if there are any younger siblings or anything out there that can justify anything that I've said against them, feel free, I'm not biased here, I'm just giving the most popular point of view. 